This week, Loveland Ski Area announced it will no longer be able to offer indoor dining or bar service for the next 30 days. So we are asking if Monarch Mountain could see similar impacts if COVID-19 cases continue to climb. Garrity on News Channel 13's Kurjan Bianca tells us what to expect if you're headed up to the slopes in Chafee County. Ski season is almost here at Monarch Mountain, but like most things, you'll want to be prepared because there are some COVID-19 modifications. Chafee County, home to Monarch, sits at level yellow on the COVID-19 dashboard dial. But as COVID cases rise, we're anticipating there could be some changes to our indoor dining situation this year. If the county hits level red, indoor dining would shut down. I think there'll definitely be some financial impact. But luckily, ticket sales and season passes make up the bulk of Monarch's revenue. For now, you'll see fewer tables inside, plus a 30-minute time limit on seating. You'll also notice increased spacing between picnic tables outdoors. And for more personal space between people. We built booths all around the perimeter of the Sidewinder Saloon. In the event that indoor dining must close, Monarch now has this a grab and go trailer called fly by burritos an outdoor offering for quick food. Eat it on our deck outdoors. They can grab it, put it in their pocket, eat it on the lift or maybe take it to their car. Staff asking skiers and boarders this season to treat your car like a locker room. They've even beefed up Wi-Fi in the parking lot and subsequently reduced Wi-Fi indoors in anticipation of any restrictions. We've been working extremely hard revamping all of our systems, basically looking at redoing every single aspect of our operation. Steps in preparation if the county hits level red. At Monarch Mountain, Kurjan Bianca, Caridad News Channel 13.